hello welcome back to my channel welcome back to another weekly vlog um it's currently tuesday i am wearing the same outfit that i wore a couple of times last week i just love it like i feel like at the minute oh, some people going past. i feel oh no there's a situation I feel like at the minute um, there's not a whole lot that like I feel super comfortable in and just with this hot weather and stuff so I'm wearing this outfit again but anyway if you are new to this channel please do subscribe if you haven't already it would mean the absolute world um, but yeah today is an exciting day we're just gonna get straight into the video today is an exciting day it's Nomi's birthday I'm currently in the car Ollie is just dropping off some parcels to the parcel shop we're dropping off the um, lounge fly that I gave away and I'm glad that that'll be on its way here he is here he is someone actually went to the parcel shop without the parcels you have to come back for him. so yes I did film some clips yesterday of me kind of preparing for Nomi's birthday did I give you the key yeah of me preparing for Nomi's birthday I showed you what I got her I did some wrapping and things like that so I will insert those clips here so the first thing is this um, Winnie the Pooh six piece writing set I picked up absolutely ages ago actually. I like Winnie the Pooh and I saw it and I know that she loves stationery um, just as much as I do so I thought this would come in handy. Next thing is one of these um, pop fidget things with a Mickey head shape. Um, she mentioned these ages ago so I thought I would get her one. I ordered some anti backs from Bath and Body Works online from our Facebook group and the seller was also selling these like body mists and this one says happy birthday on so I thought that would be perfect. I got her this badge because we were actually meant to be in Disney right now, we were meant to have gone yesterday and I wanted her to wear this then but um, obviously we're not there so maybe she can still wear it tomorrow. You can't really see it here um, but I got her this key ring, she pointed it out when we were in the Disney store ages ago so I went online and ordered it, it just says Mickey, um, she loves a good old key ring so hopefully she likes that still. I got her this mini birthday pin, I know that she collects them from the parks like when she goes um, for each year I think she said but um, yeah I thought this would be cute too this happy birthday one I got this for it to be a gift tag but it definitely um can be like a key ring and it's um I don't know if it's engraved like a lasered or something with her name so it's just a little mini and I thought that was super cute and then she's got two main presents so the first one um was probably well it's like you know the most expensive one so probably the biggest present and it is this um Winnie the Pooh. I can't get it to focus on it, but it is this little Winnie the Pooh um, charm. I will link it below if you wanted to go and look. But it says happy birthday and it's little Pooh Bear and he's wearing a little party hat and he looks super cute. So I know that she's got a Disney Pandora, so I thought that this would be perfect. And then the last present um, is something that I had made by Kim over at Kim's Crochet Creations. If you guys have been following this channel or following me on Instagram or anything, you'll know that Buzz has got two teddies from there and a blanket and we absolutely love her products. Um, she's so talented. So when I saw she could do this type of thing, I was like, oh my God, we need this for Nomi. So Kim does crochets to look like people's pets. Um, and Naomi's got a dog called Mickey, if you've watched my channel you might have seen him on there, uh, if you follow her you definitely would have seen him. Um, and so I sent a picture of Mickey and this is what Kim made, he is so amazing, like Mickey's got little curly hair and this just honestly is so, so good, she's put a little collar on him. Um, and he's just so well made and sturdy and like the way he sits up and stuff. I hope Nomi is going to absolutely love him. So I'm so excited to give him to her. I've actually bought some bibs, um, baby bibs. That are, they're like dribble bibs. And so Mickey, the real Mickey, Nomi, um, whenever it's like someone's birthday or something, she'll get him like this, um, I don't know if they're like bandanas they're called for dogs. I don't know. Um, and it will say like, it's my birthday or happy Halloween or whatever. So I thought I would try and make one for this Mickey that says like, happy birthday mommy or something like that. So we'll see how that works out. So before I wrap him, I need to make that, but I just thought I'd show you him 
whilst I'm showing everything else. Like, I'm honestly so impressed with him. Kim's done such a good job. And then I've got her this card from Buzz and this card from me. Um, we always say bestie, so I thought this was perfect. Um, although this will be from Ollie as well, obviously. I have got her bloomed because we were meant to be in Disneyland Paris, but um, obviously we're not. So what we're doing is like a bit of a day out. So it's not really somewhere where I can set this stuff up specifically um i mean i could maybe make this up and we're going for dinner at a pub so maybe i could get that hung up there um but i don't know so it's it's really annoying actually because i'd like to kind of have it set up nicely um so we'll see we'll see what i if i can do anything with these pack our bags and get in that car So I've cut um, what I want to stick on the bib. I don't know if you can really see that there. So I'm just going to eyeball it. I'm not going to measure precisely. But this is it placed on the bib right now. And then I'm just going to um, heat press it down to get that to stick on. There we go. It's on there. Happy birthday, mummy. Um, it's annoying with that blue line, it makes it a bit hard to see, but um, I'm sure she'll still get the idea. Whilst I'm here, I'll show you this other one I've made this morning. Um, this is for Father's Day, obviously. I'm talking a bit quiet because Ollie's downstairs, but um, I'm just going to stick this onto one of Fuzzy's vests. I think it looks pretty cute. There's that. Can't wait to put him in that on Sunday. Where are you looking? Let's look back to mummy. Where's mummy? Ooh, you vlogging? Mm. You holding the camera? Oh, mm. oh. I'll end up in your mouth in a minute. <laughs> um, so I've made the little bib for Mickey. And I've just put it on him. I think it looks really good. I hope that she likes it. Um, obviously, she doesn't have to leave this on the whole time because um, Kim did do a little red collar under there, if you can see it. But I thought, you know, this kind of goes with the birthday theme and it just is cute because that's what Mickey wears. So, yeah, I just had the idea and I thought I would try it and I'm so happy with it. So I'm going to go and wrap him now and then we're all wrapped up with Naomi's present. So I think she's going to really like everything that I got her. Um, I hope. Like, I do normally get nervous to give presents, but I feel like I've done a good job. I feel like, oh, we have done a good job. She um, got enough, babe. <laughs> she got me loads too. Yeah. Um, but yes. That's why you've not done a bad job, you know? Can't no, because you can get loads of stuff and it'd be rubbish, but I feel like I've got good stuff. Thank you. Um, but anyway, so we're just on the go now. We've got Buzzy in the car. Um, and yeah, we're on our way. We're driving to Lakeside, which is normally about 20 minutes away. I'm just going to put it on my phone in a moment just to see how far it's saying, like traffic-wise and stuff. And then we are, um, yeah, we're going to meet them at Putt Shack, I think, um, which is a mini golf place, but it's the best mini golf we've ever been to. It's like really electronic. Um, your balls have little chips in, and so it knows whose ball it is as soon as you put it down. Um, so you don't have to take it in like a specific turn or anything like that. And also you don't have to do the holes in any order either because it just all goes onto their little system. And it's got like fouls and, st is it fouls? Is that, it's got like foul zones. Yeah. Um, um, I think they called like hazard zones or something um, so that makes it more fun and you like get points deducted and stuff there's also a hole where you can like win things it's really really good so um, I will try and vlog a bit when we're there but yeah I'm really excited to see her she doesn't know we're coming I'm sure she does because we've just not spoke about it and like clearly we would normally speak about her birthday and like when I was gonna see her for it and stuff um, because we were meant to be in Paris, so we had this time off anyway. So Ollie just kept this day off, so we can all spend the day together. So um, it should be fun, shouldn't it? Yeah. Exciting. Um, so yeah, I will see you when, I guess when I'm with Naomi. We're just walking to Park Shack now. Oh, there they are. She's seen us already. Yeah. <laughs> there she is, done some shopping already. What do? <laughs> Hello. 
Yeah. Ron's brought you to Primark. He wanted to hello. I've got you a present. <laughs> Why have you got me a present? <laughs> Happy birthday. Thank you. I was just filming them over there instead of us. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I really filmed, but it's Naomi's birthday. We're here. We're in this nice little al fresco dining. Ron's done a good job so far, hasn't he, of the day? My boob. I know, we didn't bring his carrier though, so Ollie can't cheat today with the good luck charm. I actually think you lot should let me win today. Like, if it's, Thing if is, Naomi, I feel tough, like I have to we win. couldn't even let you. Like, you're so bad. <laughs> I'm joking. Should we get the score card from last the centre part actually wasn't that bad. Did, Did you when, finish last? No, Ollie finished last. <laughs> and me and you won, won though. It was raining from Grace for Ollie there. As as I raining, won and so did Ron, I think. Yeah. And Naomi just didn't lose when she said point. she didn't do bad. She just didn't lose. Okay, well, at like, minimum, I don't want to lose. So <laughs> Someone's going to have to take one for the team. team. You with Naomi? Yeah. Oh, you yeah, having birthday Hello. kisses? Hello. Yeah. Check yeah, in. Yeah. Say happy birthday, Nomi. Yes, Dribbler. Hello. Um, mm. 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 Uh, oh. Are you having kisses? Uh, really? Uh, really? <laughs> really? <laughs> Have you shown your raspberries? Oh, go in. Oh, go in. Are you having cuddles with Ron, Buzzy? Hello. Are you having cuddles with Ron? Say hello. Say hello. Are you going first birthday, Gil? You're my best friend. Didn't care about the rules, good on the weekends. I'll be in fools, drifting the deep space. So brave and so stupid. Just like the movies How it's gonna stay in the fight with you Just thinking we would do this until we couldn't do it Each and every high, every night with you You and me so clueless We were just broken, shattered Singing along to nothing matters Stray around like Green one. Is there a hazard one? No. But you can go in there. Oh, she did it! Straight in. Woo! For this one, it will ask you a question. This one says there's 10 players on a baseball team. And then you have to either go yes or no, or you can try and go up the middle for the super tube. Did he get it right? Yeah. True or false, the whale is blue in colour. That's very green, isn't it? True or false. I'm not going to say anything because Naomi's uh, waiting for me to say. Yeah, exactly. I don't want to say what I want. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> I mean, it's not going to actually be blue, is it? It'd be grey, wouldn't it? You being a good boy. Where's your toy? Where's your toy? Where's your toy? Where's it? Go on, Ollie, I'll watch you. Playing a new game now. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Just finished up at mini golf and we made out that we were going home. Nomi looked a bit sad. Um, and she was probably thinking, where's my presents? Like, I didn't think until after I'd like said, right, have a good rest of your day, love you, bye. Um, I didn't mean to say it, like, I just got carried away in the, like, secret of her birthday, you know? Trying to make it more fun, and then I was thinking, she thinks I've got her nothing. So yeah, I might text when I get in the car and say, I forgot your presents. I'll give them to you on Thursday. That might be a good idea. Um, yeah, I'm just waiting for Ollie to get the car, the lift. One of them's broken, so... <laughs> There was only one and there's a bit of a queue so he's just gone up the stairs and i'm here with buzzy who is snoozing with one eye open as usual can you see a little creepy 
um, but yeah, it was really good. I was rubbish, I lost both. Um, but it's still fun, like, I really love it there. <laughs> yeah, it's like, okay, see so your knickers. <laughs> <Don't get me. laughs> no. I can't really see, so it'll probably just be your lap. <laughs> Dad's prom as well. And do I yeah, open in an order, order or do I just open? He's got some shoes. He's yeah. got a bit of dribble. Are you trying to be funny? Oh. No, he has got them. I know, but okay. I didn't know whether you were being nasty. Oh, no. Of... No, you have got them. <laughs> oh. <laughs> when you said about it ages ago, I was like, I need to get that. <laughs> you no know, one likes bubble wrap. <laughs> I get a bubble pop. <laughs> <laughs> I remember you saying before. Do you remember mentioning it? Do you have it? Did you get it? Do you remember seeing it? <laughs> Everything. I don't know if you really collect. I know you said you get the year oh, yeah. ones, but, it's a little, but that one's from Buzz. No. I don't know. I can't see the screen. You don't have that. It. It it's only the poo. Uh, no, no, it's Thank you, yeah. Frank. You did make it. And it says happy. Mm. Little Winnie the Pooh. Because like, we like Winnie the Pooh. Oh, Buzzy, she's opening your card. Ooh. Thanks, Buzzy. Dad that was on holiday with, and he'd taken his two daughters. And oh we're going God. down this boobar skin. The life and he had a cockroach on him. He's done exactly the same thing as what I've just done. Oh! Who is it, Mickey? Oh, Who is it? Oh, no. What's that face? Like? Yeah, I made the little bib thing for it because I know that Mickey sometimes wears one on a birthday. It's good, isn't he? She's so clever. I saw it on her stories. Ollie, when do you think that will give it away? Like, because the colour. I was like, I doubt Naomi will go, that's Mickey. I thought she was just doing the lion hair. Oh my god, that is amazing. And like, he's really solid. Like, he sits well up well. His legs are really. Who is he? And he's got a little collar on underneath, like, if you take the bib off. And just... <laughs> he's good, isn't he? Oh, thank you. <laughs> it's okay. Is it you? Mickey? You'll have to get a little Doesn't picture of them together. Look, what's it hey. Your friend. <laughs> Hello. Who's he? <laughs> oh, oh, cute. Like <laughs> right, Mickey, lay down. Lay down. So we're just on the way to the pub now. We had a nice little time at Naomi's house. We did her presents and stuff, which hopefully you would have seen. I couldn't see my screen at all, so I hope I was filming her. I just put my camera up. I just realised, though, I've had a herb in my teeth. And I had herbs at the start of the day, like before we came out. So I'm really, really, like, I didn't just eat herbs. <laughs> or we put herbs in an omelette, which I had. And I'm really sad. If I've had a herb in my teeth this whole day, like, that's kind of not my confidence, huh? I've had two gins and I'm already drunk. Do it each and every high, every night with you. You will be so clueless. We were just broken. Hello, we're at the pub, aren't we? So you've seen the pub. Got some no, no, bubbles, no, 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 bubbles. No, no, Where's the pate? That oh, that, that is pate. Pat yeah. Oh, is it was on was a, a bread? Yeah, <laughs> it looks like bread. It's good. Naomi and I have got this. Ron's got little fishies. These little eyes. Naomi, will you eat one? I'll eat the middle. I don't know. No, can you eat the eye? Look, this one's waiting for you. Can you see its eyeball? Yeah, it's there. Thank you. It's watching you. We've got Buzzy can I here. Trying to chill out. Oh, no. Good job, Zanya. It's yummy. Gin and a gin glass. <laughs> You're back down there. Been having cuddles, haven't you? That's going to be very hot. 
Hamlet, egg, and kippies. I definitely done a bad thing. I don't like mushrooms. <laughs> Are you shivering? No. <laughs> Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to know me. Oh, getting down on one knee. Oh, <laughs> so I was being. <laughs> I'm gonna blow it. No, it's rude, but you have to make sure that I want you to blow. back in the car now we just went back to Naomi's for um to do her cake and had a nice little chat and a cup of tea and stuff and now we're just about to drive home um i really need to figure out how to have my camera setting so in light low lighting it doesn't go all weird like i really don't know how what i've done i never used to do this but anyway i am so tired so i will see you in the morning morning everyone firstly i'm gonna just say ignore how i look um I am super tired and groggy today. Um, I've actually just had a nap with Wiles. I cut, like, he was in his bed and I was in my bed, but I never, ever, ever have napped when he's napped, really. Like, I think I've tried when he was younger, but I just wasn't able to. Um, but I was honestly so tired today. It just had to be done. So that was nice, um, nice little morning nap. <laughs> um, and now I am up and about to make breakfast. Um, Ollie is just feeding him. And I'm just trying to find one of the recipes for the thing that I want to make. So we've done HelloFresh so much and um, done Gusto a bit as well. Um, but I think HelloFresh tops it for us. But yeah, we keep the recipes that we like. Like these are just the ones we like. We've done so many more than this. Um, so I'm just trying to find what I want to make today. This is what we want to make today. So it is the Charula Spiced Halloumi. Thing is, we don't have sumac and we, yeah, we don't have sumac. Oh, I didn't get spring onion either. Um, but yeah, I'm just gonna use my own salad and stuff. So I've got just some naan breads, um, just some normal naan breads. I've done it on like pita bread and stuff before, but I saw those and I thought I'd grab them. Halloumi, get the like lighter one because I don't notice the difference. Um, lettuce, tomato, cucumber, and then I will have a look and see what other veg I can put on there as well. Um, but it's honestly so good. Like when I first saw it, I wasn't really sure, but honestly, it is so good. Like I said, we don't have sumac. Um, I just use a different spice that kind of makes a yummy thing anyway. Let me grab it. This is what we use. I have no idea what it is really, or like if it's anything similar, it's probably not. I did look it up ages ago and I think I came to the conclusion that it would be okay and we've been using it and it is really yummy still so I can't even remember what like the original one tastes like anymore but this is what we make it with and yeah it's really good so I'm gonna make it now this is what it looks like when it's done I think Ollie's might have looked better but he's already started <laughs> um so yeah it's just naan bread a salad and then that spice that I put, said about and then halloumi and yeah we really like oh and like the salad is tossed in like a lime Thing. But anyway, I really like it. Is it good? Mm, yeah. yeah. Okay, yeah. good. I'm gonna eat. Yum yum yum. Good morning. It is now Thursday. I'm in the car, as you can see. We're just about to drive to the cinema. I didn't really film much yesterday. Um, for no reason really. It was just so hot. So hot. And sticky and like where I'm on and stuff I just had a bit of a tummy ache a bit of a headache and you know when you're just like meh so like I said before I'm just trying to not be hard on myself and just trying to film what I can when I want to film it and you know keep it like nice and, and easy and no stress so yeah it is raining today and grey which I love it is definitely cooler since it started raining but it's still 19 degrees which and it's muggy like the air still feels thick you know um i decided to not wear as much makeup today like i'm just wearing like a tinted bbcc cream whichever kind of thing as opposed to foundation so yeah we're driving to the cinema to watch cruella we're gonna go meet nomi there i'm gonna drop by a new look first because i've got something to return um but yeah i'm really looking forward to it we're just at blue water now the lift just beats constantly the whole time that the button's being pressed which is nice Someone just ran into the lift, they, they saw me walking towards it and they ran in it. <laughs> and they didn't have like a baby or anything, but I mean it's fine, but a bit annoying. Just waiting to go up. 
it's always awkward right now because obviously like I don't want to share the lift um you only want to do it with someone in your household and like people always try and come in just like then they just were so I just left him right there which is really awkward but anyway we're at Blue Water I'm gonna go find home what do you mean what do you mean you smile <laughs> I'm here with Nomi now. She okay. is looking cutie. How was Fort Park yesterday? Disappointed. So disappointed. It's such a shame. They went there yesterday for like extra birthday celebrations and it was really busy, wasn't it? It was so, like literally we got on two of the big rides, which is just not fun. She needs to complain, get that money back. Someone's excited for the cinema. <laughs> <laughs> that was the biggest yawn. We've just done my returns and now we're walking to the cinema, I'm going to get an ice blast and some snacks and I'm excited. Are you excited? See you, <laughs> Mummy. Okay. Get that thing out my face. So weird to be at the I cinema. I was going to say, it's going to be so weird though. Oh my goodness. Buzz's first time at cinema. Get that picture, get that picture. Whee! <laughs> it's super dark but we're in the cinema. Buzzy's having his popcorns. <laughs> Are you cutie pie? He really wants it. So I'm just quickly popping out to the shop. I don't know when I last filmed. I've been at home for a couple of hours now. But yeah, I've just been editing some of this week's vlog. Looking after Buzzy and everything like that. But I just need to quickly pop out to get something for dinner. We're having yesterday's leftovers, which was burger pasta. I don't think I vlogged it, um, but I need more burger sauce because I'm going to reheat it and then it'll go dry and there wasn't like enough for my liking in it anyway. Also going to get milk, get buzz some milk, so I'm going to quickly pop to Tesco um, to grab those bits. But yeah, had a productive afternoon. It's about, what is it now? About 20 past six. So Buzz has just woken up from a nap, um, so he probably won't go down until about 10 now. Um, but yeah. But I'll just quickly update you as what I'm up to. I'm back home now and I was just about to come in here to tell Ollie a story of what just happened at the petrol station. And then I saw my flowers and I thought I'd quickly show you. If you watched a vlog a couple of months ago, I got given a like wildflower growing set um, for my birthday. And it is really started to flower now. So if you remember, it's literally just a basket of mud. But look, lots of lovely little flowers now. The picture did show a sunflower, so I don't know where that one's gone, but <laughs> they're really cute and I really like them. Are they nice for you to look at when you're working, my pretty flowers? Mm -hmm. Hello, Buzzy. Hello. You helping Daddy? Yeah. So, I was at the petrol station and I decided to do I decided to do the pay up pump because you know how I always say like with Buzz I find it really hard to get petrol because I don't want to leave him in the car but I don't want to take him in with me and it's a faff and then I had like the brain wave of like is it a brain wave? Is that what's called? The brain wave of pay up pump so I thought I'll go and test it out on my own because I've never really used it before so I went there and I put Tesco. yeah because I went there anyway to do the shopping and I put my card in and as I put my card in, like someone spoke to me and they were saying something about a card, but it was in like an Indian accent and I couldn't really understand because um, it was like quite muffled and stuff. Um, so I was like, pardon, like, I can't really hear you. And then he started saying like um, about trying to use Apple Pay instead of a card. And I was like, oh, I don't really have my Apple Pay set up to like the card that I wanted to use, like this is the card I wanted to use and that's not on my Apple Pay, can I not just use my card? Because I already put it in and the screen was saying it was like fine and stuff. And he was, then he started saying, he started saying, I'm trying to use my Apple Pay but it's asking for a card. And then I realised that me and a man on the other side of the pump were having a conversation. <laughs> he, oh, he was speaking God. to the helper. I thought I was speaking to the helper and we were both just speaking to each other. No, he didn't realise, I don't think. I just went quiet. Oh. <laughs> So and then used... eventually he oh. then started speaking to someone whilst I was filling up fuel. So he must have been like waiting, like I pressed a button and waiting for them to answer him mm. or something. Oh god. <laughs> I was about to say that you were the one that started talking to him, but no, well, he's the first person to He talk. was, so he must have just pressed it and just assumed he'd be straight away speaking to someone. Like when it maybe was waiting or something. 
I don't really know what was going on his end, but we were having a conversation and it was awkward. <laughs> I know it's going to be a problem with the actual... No, the, the play at the pump worked really well. I've not been able to get that to work. Well, yeah, with Nat West it worked. Yeah, I did oh. it with our joint card. Um, oh. So, yeah, oh. that saves me the stress now when I want to go get petrol when I've got Buzz in the car. But do yeah. you have to do a pin or is it just a tappy? No, I have to do a pin. So you put it in first and it says maximum £99 mm. and then you put in your pin after. So I don't know if it does a thing like what happened in France where it takes the most amount. I don't know though, I don't think so. Um, but yeah, then you take it out and then you fill up. So mm. We'll see. But um, yeah, I just thought I'd share that on the vlog and I'll share it with Ollie at the same time. 21. What would you rate that out of 10 for embarrassment? Um, well, I didn't find out, so that's good. And you sort of stay quiet so True. you've got away with it it's yeah. good but yeah at the time it just felt <laughs> when i realized i was like it felt really oh <laughs> you know that that gif where homer yeah, like goes into a bush but we couldn't see each other because it was How the did screens you know? How did you know? know what that it wasn't the thing yeah you must have sort of glanced over and saw him talking no because i just realized like then i realized the voice wasn't coming out of the machine it was like i don't know like mm. i could I knew there was someone there, I could see like a, I don't know, I just knew. Okay, yeah. How do you know you're going to get away with it then? Because it's not like you've sneakily looked and you might have seen you. No, but it was just still funny. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to take over charge of little man. Oh, there he looks like he's having a lovely time with daddy. You stay there. Daddy's like, nope. <laughs> a gorgeous boy. Morning, it's now Friday. Say hello everyone. We're both up and washed and dressed, aren't we? All fresh. Been up for quite a long time this morning. My skin is so bad at the minute, so I just ignore that. Um, but I thought I would quickly just film this because I ordered a, or actually no me ordered, um, but I built it on this website, a stamp for Hamilton. Um, if you guys don't know, or if you're new to this channel, I've got a small business called Hamilton Crafts. Um, and I usually, to be honest, like don't necessarily brand my boxes when I post them out. Sometimes I'll put stickers on them, but most of the time it's like such a rush that I just don't do that. But I really think finishing touches and stuff do make a difference. So I've wanted to get a stamp for a while, but I've just never got around to doing it. Um, but I finally got one. Um, so it just looks like this with my logo on there. Um, and Nomi gave me an ink stamp for it yesterday. So I'm gonna give it a go, see what it looks like. So I thought I would show you. I'm just gonna do it in my um, in my planner because I like to keep special things in there anyway and I think it is kind of special. Oh, I'm chuffed with that. Look, it's come out so good. I'm gonna see if it's gonna work again. Oh, it dried out a little bit by then, but look. Um, I'm really happy with that. I think that looks really good and I can hopefully stamp all my boxes and my envelopes and stuff when I send out orders. Like I said it is Friday, we have no plans today, it is raining and grey and horrible out um, so I don't know what we're going to do. It's hard to keep little man entertained in all day, little grizzler, you can hear him. I'm bored, I'm bored mummy, I've lost my keys, anyone seen my keys? Anyone seen my keys? Oh there they are. I found them. I found them for you. I did. I did. Good boy. Um, so yeah, we might drive to Blue Water again. Um, I just go to Blue Water so much. Oh god, my skin. I was hoping Buzz was going to have a bit of a longer nap. But he didn't. So, <laughs> um, yeah, I really, really, really need to get us signed up for some baby groups. I need to find some like drop-in ones that I don't have to commit to every week and pay for like the whole term, you know? Because I just never know what we're going to be doing. But it's nice to have that freedom. Um, so anyway, I'm going to sort that little man, give him some milk. And yeah, I just thought I'd show you my stamp. I'm quite happy with that actually. Whoop, whoop, whoop. There you go. Oh, wow. Oh, that's so kind of you. You'll have to ignore the noise of Buzz's play mat. He's just there, just playing. I think he's got a bit hot now. He's playing with the cushion instead. 
He has been like reaching up for all of these bits, which he's never done before. Um, we've not been on the playmat in a little while though, have we? I like to kind of get it out every now and again. Um, so he gets bored of the same stuff if he's on it all the time. So it's like kind of new every time. Um, and then we'll go through a phase of being on it every day and then we'll have a bit of a break kind of thing. But um, yeah, he's chilling. So I'm going to write this and uh, make me laugh. You see what it says? Tee hee hee hee. So, Buzzy's been playing on his mat. Bit fed up now of it, aren't you? We've had the foil blanket out. We've had lots of toys. We've had the lights and the music. Um, so now we've decided to sit on his little chair in his room and read some books. Um, we've got a few books up on our bookshelf up there. Um, so I've just pulled three down to sit and have a little flick through. I've just made lunch, I've just made corn nugget wraps, I just have a bit of salad, um, like Nando's, Perronese, corn nuggets and then I've just done a couple of extra for us to have as well but um, yeah this is a really yummy lunch that we like to have quite often, we've not had it in a while though so yeah always a good one to have so I'm just going to wrap these up and I normally put a bit of cheese in but I just can't bother today <laughs> so that's what we're going to have. Just back upstairs now, we're really having such a nothingy day like I'm sorry, I'm even updating you because it's boring. But this is kind of interesting. Um, but first I'll show you. I've got a little snoozer here. And his little dribble bib. Nakey time. Um, look where he's caught the sun. I have been like so good with sun cream, but he's still caught the sun, bless him. Um, but anyway, I've had a delivery this morning of a Father's Day present that I've ordered for Ollie. Um, I actually only ordered this not yesterday, the day before, and it said that I had missed, like, um, the arrival, you know, I'd missed the cut-off for it to come before Father's Day, unless I paid express postage. I didn't pay express postage, and it's still here, and it is Friday, so, um, yeah, it could have come tomorrow as well, like, so plenty of time, but, um, yeah, it's this personalised storybook. There's quite a few of them, like, online, and, um... I thought it would be a nice thing to get, obviously, for Ollie to read with Buzz. And I've chosen this one because it's, um, like, the black and white style, which, I mean, Buzz, I think, has got a lot better sight now, um, according to, like, Wonder Weeks and stuff. But he does still seem to really love, like, the contrast, the high contrast stuff. So I thought I'd get a black and white one. Um, so it's obviously, like, a book that's kind of pre-designed and then you just fill out a couple of bits of information and they, like... Um, amend it to suit you so here's the cover um, Ollie and I have like a special thing about elephants and yeah so I thought this would be super cute but yeah so it says Buzz's Daddy um, and then it's got these really lovely pictures and then it says this book is for my daddy Oliver Frapwell love Buzz um, thank you daddy for being my best friend and helping me every day Thank you, Daddy, for feeding me with yummy food. My favourite is Milkies, because obviously that's all he has right now. <laughs> um, thank you, Daddy, for loving me as much as you do, even more than peanut butter M&Ms, because that's, like, one of Ollie's favourite snacks. <laughs> um, thank you, Daddy, for reading me the best bedtime stories and doing all the funny voices. Um, thank you, Daddy, for making every day an adventure, especially when you take me to the swimming pool. Um, so, like that was one where I got to choose kind of what adventure it was um thank you for spending so much time with me I never feel lonely when I'm with you thank you daddy for playing lots of games with me my favorite is dancing in the mirror this was another one that I like chose and Ollie always like holds Buzz in front of the mirror and like wriggles around with him and Buzz loves it so I thought that was a cute thing to put um and then yeah it's just a really really lovely book um and then at the end, I could leave a little note. So that's what I did. Um, and yeah, this is like the soft like um, cover version. I think you could have paid an extra £6 or something to get a hardcover one. But um, a lot of Buzz's books are soft cover. And whilst he does I try to grab them now, <laughs> I figured it should be okay if we keep hold of it and stuff. But yeah, I thought that was a cute little last minute present. <laughs> I hadn't really got anything so um, yeah I thought I'd just show you that but really impressed with that and this was from a company called I think it was Letterfall or letterfest.com um, 
so yeah really impressed with that really like it and I just need to wrap it up I guess now I need to um oh I've written the Father's Day card already so yeah we're all good to go I have a I have a tendency to go a bit overboard on like birthdays and stuff like that but um I'm currently saving for something so um yeah Ollie isn't really like he would always prefer for us to save money he's not like big into material things or anything like that so that's why I just thought the book would be a nice thing and then we're gonna go out for a nice day on Sunday for a little afternoon tea I've sorted that he doesn't know about so yeah hopefully it'll be a lovely day anyway um I think Mother's Day we had a McDonald's and went for a walk and I was chuffed so <laughs> um yeah I'm gonna carry on Buzz is snoozing so um I've just been sat here trying to plan some video things I don't tend to plan my like content um <laughs> sound like such a twat saying content um because who do I think I am you know but I don't tend to plan things that much um but there are a couple of videos that I just want to kind of remember to do. I've written some lists and I, I'm going to carry on just doing that whilst Buzz is snoozing. It's still raining, it's still grey, um, but I'm having a really nice day. Like Buzz has been a good little sausage. So yeah, just thought I'd show you that because it just got delivered and I'm going to crack on whilst Buzz is sleeping. But really there's nothing going on today. Sorry. <laughs> I was grumpy and had cabin fever, so Ollie's brought us the home bargains. What a treat for a Friday. I recognise the signs of the cabin fever. <laughs> well early, didn't I? Yeah. <laughs> What's the sign? Tearfulness. Slipped a bit, yeah. A mess. <laughs> I still look a mess. <laughs> so we're at the mothership. <laughs> look at him. He fell asleep. What are you after today? Oh, I thought you were looking at this thing. <laughs> now come to TK Maxx. I prefer home sense, but we don't have one near us. So we're gonna come in. Maybe my favorite aisle in TK Maxx is the like stationary aisle, but I have way too many notebooks already. Um, unless there's, you know, a really nice one that comes along. Oh, there's a little rat. Oh, it's George Orwell, 1984. We have come to McDonald's. <laughs> my nephew said to me, Hello Max if you're watching <laughs> and Toby but Max said to me that I seem to go to McDonald's in every single weekly vlog and <laughs> I don't think that's true but I'm proving him right this week so we've come to McDonald's we're just at the click and serve thing which top tip guys if you don't have the McDonald's app you should get it because they always have offers on there like we've got 30% off today um and yeah you just order it and then you sit in this click and serve and then they just bring it to your car. So like, there's always such a big queue at our drive-through, especially right now, like on a Friday evening, like there's a big queue, so. Any evening. Huh? Any evening. Any evening, but yeah, any like. Any time of day. Any time, what Lee thinks is so this busy here. McDonald's is mad, yeah. No, it's not always. It's so busy. <laughs> um, Cause we're basically in London, kind of. Mm. <laughs> I feel like, I don't know. Um, but yeah, so having the click and serve on the app is really helpful as well. But yeah, the fact like you save money um, is really good. So at least we're not sat in the queue. We're just sat here chilling and then they'll just bring it over. Um, you just pay on your phone and everything like that. So yeah, if you <laughs> like McDonald's too, then I would recommend getting the app. Um, so yeah, we're just waiting for that to come. And then what football is it? England versus Scotland. The mm -hmm. Euro Euros. Um so that's on tonight at like seven, eight. I think it's eight, isn't it? So we should get home just in time for it. It's about half, it's 25 past seven. Look like absolute trash, so. Yeah, you don't have to hear me anyway. Mumbles, doesn't mm -hmm. he? I always tell him to speak up. Um, <laughs> but I sound really bugged up anyway, so. Anyway, we're gonna go home and watch that. I don't really like the football that much, but when it's something like the World Cup or something like that everyone can get into, you know, then I do quite enjoy it bit of the old community spirit in that. Do I mumble when we were friends? No. Oh, when we were friends, you're so excitable that you just want to show off. <laughs> <laughs> it's just when you're with me. Yeah. Buzz has been asleep 
the whole time we feed out he didn't really sleep today so i'm not surprised but it doesn't bode well for like this is normally his bedtime <laughs> or it was before his sleep progression he has been going to sleep a little bit later hasn't he that is what we're up to so yeah i guess i'll probably just see you in the morning now bye bye ollie's working in the morning aren't you doing some gardening Evelyn and Clive. Evelyn and Clive. They're a couple that he has gardened for for years. Um, when he was at uni, he used to do a bit of gardening, just like some extra cash. And he doesn't do it anymore, but he still sees them. So, yeah, he's going to go and do that. And then we're going to see our friends Alex and Jen for dinner in the evening. But other than that, I don't know what we're up to. I feel like I I've been... saw someone at work. I was gardening for an elderly couple. And they came out and they said, oh, is that like charity? Like, yeah. <laughs> charity that I earn money from. <laughs> They like the help. I'm not. I don't, I don't over, overcharge them at all. No, yeah. they're really lovely. The guy does it with you, doesn't he? A bit sometimes. Yeah, yeah. Evelyn says that I, when I'm there, he, he likes to do stuff then. Yeah, because he probably doesn't want to pay. Up. Yeah, he probably doesn't want to pay. They'd be like me. Yeah. And make sure that. I don't have to do too much. <laughs> but it's good because he doesn't have to take away the like gardening waste and stuff. Like when he was gardening before, like properly, oh, a car was stunk of like mm. leaves and mud. Sometimes the rubbish would have to stay in overnight. It's all with like the bugs, dew and... from the grass and stuff, wouldn't it? Yeah, and then there'd be spiders. Moldy grass. It was awful because that's what smells the most. The grass. I think. Yeah, because yeah, like yeah, if the dump had shut or something. Or he couldn't make it there when he was finished. He'd have to sit in the car overnight. And then, oh, it just was not nice. And also, then, when he was doing it, he had all his own tools and stuff. Whereas Clive and Evelyn, like, you just go and use their yeah, mower and that's, stuff. Yeah, that's the main reason I'm still with them, really. So, yeah, it's really easy. It's a nice little one to carry on doing. And they're really lovely. Like, they always said a little Christmas card and stuff like that as well. So, yeah. anyway. They love pictures of Buzz, too. Yeah, they probably should meet him at some point. But, um. What are you doing tomorrow? <laughs> I will see you in the morning. Bye. Bye. <laughs> morning, everyone. Say good morning. Good morning. Good morning. We are out. I don't normally get embarrassed in public, but there's people right there. Yes. Um, so we've just come to um, Bexley Heath, which is a town centre kind of near us. Um, we had to get a couple of bits um, to return some stuff to Asda, pick up a couple of bits and I've just been to Marks's because there was something specific I wanted to get from there so I'll show you that when I get home. We just stopped in Starbucks, haven't we? Mostly so I could feed little man. Sat down nice and easy but I thought I'd start the vlog as well um, for the day. So ignore what I look like as usual. Hopefully I look a bit better later. Yeah. I figured like hopefully I'm not really gonna see anyone I know and um, I'd rather like not do my makeup now because I want it nice for later and I just sweat so much in a mask. Um, so I've just got a caramel um, frappuccino decaf but I forgot my reusable cup like I always have one pretty much in Buzz's bag and I took them out. I took them out so I had to get a, a like dispose. He's just grinning at me. So I had to get a um, like a one-time use one which is so annoying because a bad for the environment and b you save money when you use a reusable one and what a bad advocate for my own bloody business am i hey you guys don't know i make um lots of things including like personalized starbucks cups and stuff you love your new toy it. you got it yeah gonna have a quick pit stop so I can feed him, have my drink, and then we've got a couple more shops to go to, and then we'll be back home. Look at this, when my fake tans come off in my neck, like my chest and everything, it's still super brown, but I've got a weird neck gap. <sighs> Guys, we share it all here. <laughs> um, the fan is on, so if you can hear that, that's why. Alexa, stop. Thank you. Um, we are just back now. I also wanted to say, um, I thought about it last night, I was like thinking that you guys probably think we're really skanky and never change our bed in, um, because we quite often have had this one on recently. Um, but it's because where it's been so hot, we've been like washing it and then it dries on the line like really quick. So like rather than fold it up and put it away, we just put this one back on. Um, 
that's why um, so I thought I'd quickly just mention that whilst I remembered but anyway we are back from the shops now um, I was going to say daddy but he's not your daddy but it's because Buzz is here Ollie is still um, working so I thought I'd just quickly show you everything that we got today Okay, so these are the bits we got him for Father's Day. So obviously I showed you this book yesterday. I just picked up a gift bag from Asda. We do tend to be those people who reuse gift bags. Um, a, because obviously it saves money, but B, like, it's so wasteful um, to just use it once and throw it away. Like, we always kind of keep hold of them and we'll reuse them um, amongst ourselves or if they're like, you know. We, I would much rather kind of them not just get thrown away. I did buy one because it's his first Father's Day and I saw it and I thought it was cute. But yeah, so you just peel off the sticker and stick it there um, of who you want the bag for. Um, this was something I specifically went out for. I saw an advert for it and it is a um, My Hero Colin the Caterpillar. So it's like a half size Colin but with a cape on and I thought that was really cute. Whilst I was in m and I also saw this in the Father's Day section and it is so heavy, like, I don't know, it's mad. I wouldn't normally um, pick this up because I had already picked this up, but it is peanut butter and Ollie loves peanut butter. So I thought he could have that, although that does look very peanutty. So yeah, we'll have to see, get him to do a taste test. And then <laughs> I got him some Pokemon cards. Um, this is a bit of like a running joke, but also not like he actually enjoys to play Pokemon. He used to collect like, because there's an actual physical game. And I know it sounds super geeky, guys, but it's actually a really good game. <laughs> um, like a good, like, card game. I really enjoy to play it anyway. We've not played it for years. Um, but when you get the cards, there's a code that you can enter to, like, have them on an online thing, which is what he plays if he's going to play it. So I thought he could have the physical cards, but also I know there's the codes in there that he would like. Um, and I think they're new ones that he hasn't got. So I got those. And then lastly... He wears, like, he isn't someone who buys new clothes often. Um, and these are literally just from Asda. And looking at them now, I don't know if they're a bit old manny, but his favourite pair of shorts, they are actually beige. They didn't have the colour that I wanted. Um, but his favourite pair of shorts have literally worn through, like, at the crotch because he has had them longer than we've been together. And we've been together ten and a half years. <laughs> um, so, yeah. They didn't have the beige ones that he probably would have wanted to place, but um, I figured like navy kind of goes with most things as well as beige does, if you know what I mean. So um, yeah, I thought I'd get them for him anyway. They're super soft and the ones he had before were from Asda. I looked in the label. So yeah, these are seem like pretty good match to be fair. So I'll see if he likes them. If not, I can just take them back. But I saw them and I thought I'd pick them up as well. So yeah, that's literally just a few little bits I got for him. Um, or Buzz got for him. Did you get daddy presents? Yeah. Yeah. We need to get you dressed for the day. We've been out and about in your pajamas, haven't we? Haven't we? Yeah. A gorgeous, gorgeous boy. Let's get this all wrapped up before Daddy comes home. Are you good at wrapping? Yay! Ollie's home now. Hello. Where's your t-shirt? I'm one of those England fans. <laughs> Such a lad. Um, but yeah, I just have come down. We're just making some sausages to have a little sausage we get for lunch. But oh, oh, well, that's bad. These sliders. I've got holes in the bottom. I guess like in case you're going to a swimming pool or something, I don't really know why. I No, I stood on the doormat. It just all slopped in my foot. Anyway, I'll come out because we have these planters here, which if you, I don't know if I vlogged when Ollie built them or not, but we've had them for a little while. But we did have like lavender. We've still got lavender. It's come out really nice now. Um, and this other bush. But then Ollie sprinkled like wildflower seed all in it. Um, and look how cute. So it's really nice and bright and colourful now. They're just starting to all come out. And there's loads more like these are going to be the poppies as well. 
they're all just starting to come out and the bumblebees are loving it and it just looks really nice nice and bright I mean it might look a bit of a mess too but it's nice to have some nice colorful flowers there anyway but um yeah Ollie is home from gardening he told me he had a hot cross bun there look at this parenting on the go eh his Red Bull tin. He's got a Red Bull there, but I don't think he's opened it. Uh, it's just oh, there for product drink. placement. So there, right? <laughs> um, so yeah, we're having sausage baguettes for lunch. Ollie's just doing the sausages. I'm gonna chop up baguette and butter it and get the sauce out. Um, and then yeah, I think I'm probably gonna end this week's weekly here because, well, tonight we're going to see friends who I don't vlog with. Um, I'm going to wash my hair. I only, I'd only, i really got it to a good condition where I was able to just wash it like every kind of four days. Um, it used to be every other day, but then it was like relying on it, you know. But um, because it's been so hot, it's just getting greasy really quick. So I might wash my hair and then, yeah, just get ready for tonight and stuff. So I think I'm only going to end it here. Oh, I'm just looking at these flowers. I think I showed you them a couple of days. More have come out now. Look how pretty. So many green fingers we have. You're going to end the vlog for the week? Go for getting my green fingers, my gloves. My gloves are green. <laughs> They're all soggy. I just washed them. Look at how he's feeding him. <laughs> Poor Buzzy. Oh, he had to put it in himself. He's got to learn some way, he? Oh. Bye. <laughs> thank you so much for watching this week's weekly vlog if you enjoyed it um then please do subscribe give it a thumbs up leave me a comment because i love seeing who actually watches my videos it really does help me out as well like so many of you guys message me on instagram and stuff and say that you love my videos which is so kind of you um, and i just love more and more people to join along with our little journey so um yeah if you do enjoy my videos please do let me know and um yeah, I will see you very soon. It's Father's Day tomorrow, so I'm going to end this vlog here because it's already quite long because it's like Naomi's birthday and stuff. Um, but I will vlog tomorrow, so that will be the start of next week's weekly. And I don't know what else we're up to, but I'm sure it will be lots of fun. So I will see you very soon for another video. Thanks for watching. Bye. I just want to love you. Just